Yeah, who had passed anything for this life? They don't have yeah. 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 trap. Yes. They don't have yeah. 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 It is the right time, the right season, the right period, right? To talk about our finances and um, the little hiccups here and there that we encounter along the way when it comes to investment. And the most important thing, the one that people used to fall victim of a lot. <laughs> yahoo, yahoo. <laughs> Am I a yahoo boy? Chan, Chan, Am I Chan, 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 be poor. She call it scam. Uh, okay. Um, you get, right? Mm, all right. <laughs> So, um, today's a good day to talk about... Um, scam. Scam. Yes. Fraud that. Yes. Yow, yow, boys. I guess. This girl is vast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but obviously, we're not going to be doing this alone. We have... Um, a guest with us, a very special guest, mm-hmm. and he's he's an expert in this field, especially in the field of yes. investment, money, finances. Mm. I like his Instagram bio. His Instagram bio says, Africa's most experienced <laughs> financial... <laughs> Is he advice or investor now? Coach. Investor. Coach. Yeah, coach. Financial coach. Um, coach, rather. I'm like, oh, grr. <laughs> like, for that kind of CV, you have to come correct. I you hope know. You come correct. <laughs> <laughs> yes, guys, this is Yeye Talk Podcast. As usual, we're here to say the truth and nothing but the truth. Always. And in as much as we call it Yeye Talk, you already know that by now we talk about serious things, mm-hmm. serious issues. And today we're here to come to the rescue of those that have fallen victim, not once, not twice, mm-hmm. not Three times those that regularly fall victim of um fraud, internet fraud, um four one nine basically. Scam, not, not even not even just scammers, that. Scammers, scammers really. as well, yes, and scammers. as well as bad investment. Bad investment because we've had that happen over and over again where people would put their money into something they promised them ridiculous ROI and then yes, at and the end know, of the day like MMM everything disappears. Others, others you know, put money into here and get. Have you, have you, have you ever lost money God in that for form? I won't put, like people have told me regular um, like times is the number put money in this you get I'm like any money that mm. somebody tells you to put into this and you're not working to to you know get revenue or to increase that money mm-hmm. to make profit and mm-hmm. like I, I'm putting money into this and in three weeks time I'll get but, but, but you know but you know that but you know that at some point it became a little bit um, interesting in the sense that. People started coming from the angle of, okay, we are helping you invest your money in agriculture. We're helping you invest your money in transport. We're helping you invest your money in real estate. And then maybe <laughs> after one year, your money would have, you know, grown. If and you know, if you say after one year, that's mm. the kind of reasonable. But that one's still the fault. This is the scatter. This is the scatter. Uh-huh. Yeah, exactly. At least, you, you, like, you, you had the whole, okay, oh, at the back of my head, mm. maybe there are some things working in the background to yeah. you know, generate that money within this length of time. But mm-hmm. the one that you tell me after three weeks, I will get. <laughs> please, you know, you put um, your money inside. So see, okay. yeah, bad, 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 bad investment right is not about <laughs> duration. Actually, at the end of the day, well, it's not really about duration. Things can go south. Here. Yes, we and I'm very, very here. interested in hearing all that it will be dishing out today, ladies way, and gentlemen. Have, before you ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> them, I have to say you look good. Your afro is afro when Thanks, my love. <laughs> Thank you. You have, to, you, know, you have to do that. You have to like, give it. African yes, Barbie? Co- yes, have, you, have you seen a Barbie today? So, <laughs> just be a two-face on the show. You know, African queen. Oh, she hey. baby. The girl. You know they lose oh, focus. My guess, my guess is like, please, who are these people? <laughs> you know they lose focus. My name is Mide and that's Moyo, obviously. <laughs> 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 this is Shakaya for me. But guys, you already know what we're talking about. And you know always that as much as we bring in serious conversation to the table, we also ensure that we br- put in a bit of laughter and fun in there because at the end of the day, Sha, people are going through a lot. So we're not yeah. here to come and be all serious and uptight. We want to ensure that you learn and you learn in a fun way. Yes. And today, we are all going to learn about finances, investments you should run away from. Mm. And those ones you probably should be looking at because I know that it's going to have a lot of advice for people especially as it concerns how to grow your money but doing it reasonably and not be greedy About because now greedy kill a lot of people right. but let's tell you again the name of our guest is Mr. Gigi and he's your guest boy Gigi 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 Gigi
Okay, no, let's go into that. Let's see Raz Drew. I'm not like this. Welcome on board. How are you today? I'm fine. Good to have you. I feel like a very calm person for you. No, you are because not calm because I've seen your Instagram videos <laughs> and I've seen your TikTok videos. You are uh, not calm. No. What's happening? You are not calm. I you talk about money. Maybe the... <laughs> online is here from <laughs> offline. I don't know where they get. Yeah. Yeah. So I want to have now online. They go online. I know, but yeah, it will Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay, uh, so uh, imagine that you have your Instagram audience or your TikTok audience in front of you. Yes. Uh-huh, so give us that energy. Oh, you yeah, don't worry. Are okay. you? Yeah. It's still there, be the load, be the cook, be the cook, be the boy. Nah, small, small, no That's small, that. small. <laughs> Thank you for joining us on the couch today. Right. You know, a lot, I mean, from, from my introduction, you know that we, we know a lot about people who have had to who have experience about bad investments, right? Who've had to put their money into stuff they think would come back and eventually they lost it all. Mm. First, let's start with finance itself. You know, there are so many aspects, so many angles, so many thoughts regarding what should be and should not be when it comes to money. How would you say people get wealthy? Is it by just earning or everybody must invest by fire by force? Yes. Like, you don't get wealthy by how much you make. Hmm. You don't get where the how much you make. Okay. You get where the how much you're able to put into good use. Mm. You understand? Yes, yeah, that's why you right. see a lot of people, they make so much money, mm. uh, but they don't have any evidence of the money they are making. Mm. You can be making one million a monthly, mm. but at the end of the day, somebody will be saying maybe now hundred k they make monthly. Mm. If that person get the wisdom mm. of finance, you say with time, the person can go beyond. You will be saying you they make more. Mm. And that person. So it's not about um, what you they get, but what you they use, what you they get. They, they, they get. You think they use what you they, they get, get too. Yeah, so yes. like if I if I want to interpret that, it mm. probably means that we must invest. Yes. But is what, that what well, it means? People, is it by force? Exactly. <laughs> there are people that save rather than invest. Mm. You know because. Investment. I don't know when my money will cook and right. come back to me. Yeah. At least save this. I know say the. I know they spend them, but at least the day the day I need it, I mm-hmm. say I feel just withdraw. Mm-hmm. Right. But for investments, you have to wait until you, you finally see your arrow. Until, until, <laughs> until you mature. Until jungle <laughs> mature. You know, mature. <laughs> yeah. yeah, like like which you talk for then now. Uh, investment itself mm. is like planting now. Right. Mm. You don't just plant today, then you reap. Mm. I don't like to get all these things. Right. Yeah. So, yeah, so so when you plant, mm. you wait for your seed to germinate. To germinate, right. Uh, so the fruit is the profit. Mm. That's what they get. Which mm. would you now say is mm. more important, to invest or to save? Or to save. Saving will destroy your money. Okay. Let's say, for instance, now you bought a car last year. Right. Maybe 4.5 million era. Mm. Can 4.5 million era buy the same car for you this year? I don't like the game with that. That one hits so me. So when shot. you keep your money, <laughs> that one yet uh-huh. depressed even too much. With the way the dollar Six is rising, mm. the, the the cost of tomato today is not the cost not of the tomato. Cost. Yeah. No, that's so somebody who is worth ten million era last year, right? This year you're not worth ten million era again. Right. You're worth something less, maybe like five million. Say. Mm. Because witty ten million era buy for you even last month, mm. you know if you buy this month again, the power of inflation. So saving will reduce the worth. Of your, of money. your money. That's why investment is very, very important. Right. So, so when we now talk about this investment, mm. because, you know, everybody come around and they're saying, invest, 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 mm. invest. And then sometimes you don't even know, because you gave an example of someone who is earning 100,000 naira. Mm. And you're like, if the person know what it's supposed to do, mm. um, if he grow that money. And, so now the question is, mm. what is we supposed to do? What, okay, what because you what am I supposed to do with my money? <laughs> what am I supposed to put my money that would help me become rich? Because at the end of the day, this culture, this economy that we are looking at, um, even if you are any one million naira, it they tough sometimes. Yeah, tough. Yes. So what what is what exactly am I supposed to be doing with money? Yes, that's, I love that question. You know, so when you talk about invest, 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 mm. one of the questions people they ask me always now why are they very different from the rest financial experts we really mm. hear about? Because maybe that person is okay. I'll tell you, so you do this thing with your money, and you put that money to that thing, mm. and you go be successful. But you need to understand the different stages of investing or going into business. Mm. Like you, let's say be, maybe you be upcomer now. Maybe you never do business before. So what you need is not a business or investment. You need the knowledge of a business. Mm. 
So he said, take that again. Mm. <laughs> take it again. <laughs> there, was a, there was an epiphany right there. Yeah, take it again. So you need to invest in the knowledge of a business. So it's like, who don't walk out the road before you? Mm. The power of mentorship. Mm. Who don't go before you? So when you humble yourself enough to learn from people who are already doing well in this business, mm. then you will see, say, you will be successful in a few years. That's why you say the Igbo people, they are most, and they are the most successful people in the Business or as in for Nigeria, yeah. Right. Uh-huh. 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 That's all it is. Because awesome. because of the power of mentorship, because yeah. you know if you see Boma will be saying if you say maybe you won't go into business and you never see what they do one before. Mm. If you will serve a guy for like five years, mm. ten years, mm. eight years, mm. I don't know that they get. Mm-hmm. You will say even with three hundred thousand there will be so guy go balance, maybe after eight years of serving a guy, mm-hmm. they will give maybe like three hundred thousand. Mm. You will see in less than two years, mm. that same person is already successful in that business because of the power of mentorship. mentorship. Now, this is people don't know. So, so if I go break with and just talk down now, mm. it means say, not be just to invest, but to follow people we know. We know. Yes, so. To follow people we yes. don't do something where they're successful so that you say, we well, can't try that thing. Now, is that what you're saying? Yes, yes. You'll be like, if you see anybody who say the person is successful, yeah, those people, they have blueprint of the success track. If you see the way people like them, that go to dinner. Mm. They don't follow the process. You know what I said? So, for you not to waste your time mm. uh, and your money, mm. so the best way to look for person is to already get the result. Mm. Why not just follow the process with the person will know the road? You're walking through the process. Mm. Then it will be very easy for you. So, what is this process? Because at the end of the day, there are mm. different investment opportunities, right? Mm. And p- different people have interest in different things. Yes, right. that's right? true. Because I remember that at some point, it feels like investment in Nigeria was about doing what was working. Like everybody was just joining the bandwagon. So they, they would say, is that we got everybody's investing in, uh, before you know, uh, agri tech, you know, they say everybody, <laughs> you know, in fintech, yeah, agri tech, every tech, say community, people will jump, invest in it before you know, money don't enter ground. At some point, they said it was uh, Bitcoin. Everybody uh, entered that one too. <laughs> uh, everything started crashing. At some point, they say, well, you know, there's been a lot of, jumping around yeah. yeah so is it that is it that what the mentors do is to go and first test the water of all of these things and they come and tell us that we oh, yeah, invest this your money you or what exactly what exactly is that person a mentor is somebody who is doing that when we say you get for mine to do mm-hmm. i don't know really they get so let's say for instance your mentor is somebody who's into crypto mm-hmm. like what you said or maybe into real estate mm-hmm. uh-huh. so your mentor did into real estate so you go walk you through the process of what? Real estate, mm. not be crypto. Mm. So if your interest is for crypto, who you know we say they do well for crypto, mm. you go feel walking through the process. Now these mm. things, you, you, I don't know that they get. I they get you. And uh, things like this. So okay. it means that you're looking for a mentor in line in with line what with you what want yes. to yes. invest yes. in. Yes. Okay, mm. so in this whole investment thing now, mm. right? I mean, there are certain things that, like you mentioned crypto, you mentioned um, real estate and stuff. There are certain things that is just seasonal. You don't invest in it for long term. It's just mm. seasonal. For example, crypto. I, I don't really hear people talking about crypto now. I mean, I'm, I'm sure it's still there, but it's not as... As, as it used as to be some years back. Yeah, it used to be, exactly. Yeah. But then there are also things that you invest in that you know that this one is lifelong. There are things that just never fade. Mm. The fashion or the style never fades. Mm. Like, for example, real estate. Mm. When if you invest in real estate, just so that yeah, I, I don't know, but I just feel like you are made for life. Especially if you could, so can you? And I know that you you, you talk a lot about mm. real estate. You talk about <laughs> there's one controversial thing you posted on mm. Instagram. You said um, living in a rented apartment is better than building better a house. than building a house. Yes. And I saw, explain. I, so, <laughs> I, so when you talk about things like yeah. that, so can you can you talk can you expatiate on the or expatiate on the credibility in those investment mm. um, opportunities? Those investment opportunities. Mm, like like what you said now, building a house is what living in a rent is better than building a house. Yeah. The advice depends on the stage of life you are. Okay. Mm. For somebody, let me be you be young boy now. You just made your first million. Or you made your first ten million era. You don't think you are supposed to build a house with that money. Mm. Uh, so the best advice for you: Why don't you just rent an apartment? Hmm? Depends on the environment where you did. You rent an apartment. You rent as you rent that place. Maybe your and it's all this. It depends on the present source of income where you already get to. Mm. Because if that your ten million era now, ten million would be say maybe he just come once, and maybe the source is not a promise source. We'll be say okay now. Nah, if they come on a daily 
mm-hmm. basis or weekly basis or monthly basis. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. If you're not getting it like that, the best you're supposed to do, you get an apartment, mm-hmm. you will go into a business. You understand? Then from the fruit of your business, now from there, you see the builders. Build Even though by the time you come carry your maybe your 10 million and I go pay for, pay for house, that 10 million is not even complete house. Mm. I don't know where you they get. Mm. That's why you, today now you see a lot of uncompleted buildings mm. because of people who be say they don't have a stable source of income, but you, the small thing we call it out their hand. They call it like, okay, now, now oh, the time for them to. Project. Yes, we will start projects now. Your source of income don't post now. You want to complete the house. But mm. you also, that's just one post because then, yes. I know this is not a follow up post, but I, I just kind of like linked both of them together because. Now you still talking. Yes. <laughs> you talk say mm. or person talks say you 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 I think you did a screenshot of, yes. of it. Person talks say um building house to rent out mm. now also waste of money. Yes. Because and then you you actually buttress the person's point because you can't talk say imagine say you spend maybe like sixty million yes. or thirty million to build house. You mm. they correct um, collect rent every month of say six million or seven million. Yes. By the time you turn and go leave, you go still take another thirty million to repair everything where the person don't spend. That's true. So I want you to because now because we are not asking but that because are because on investing, the, investing in, exactly. in because on the flip side we also have people who would recommend rental income as an amazing um, investment, well, investment or exactly. growing your wealth. So See, all of these things can't get confusing. See, we are, like this now. All this is the bit of confusion. Okay. The stage of life you are okay. matters a lot. Mm. Uh, you know, real estate like when you talk about real estate rental income, not before you will be saying you won't start your life. Let's mm. say, for instance, now in the aspect of a building a house for rent, mm. let's say, for instance, you spend 60 million naira to build a house. Mm? And that 60 million naira depends on the area where you do. Mm-hmm. And you know, say Nigeria, the way that they pay rent for Nigeria, not be said they for abroad. Mm. And Nigeria rent maybe not yearly that they pay. Yearly, yeah. You go spend 60 million naira to build a house now. Maybe that house now, there are some places. Because when people they talk about uh, rental income, maybe you want to mention Lekki, Lagos, and all this. But not forget, so this Lagos, you ask, oh. It's not even up to maybe ten percent of Nigeria population and the rest mm. part of the world, mm. uh, the rest part of the Nigeria. Okay. Uh, so let's say maybe you go build us for that kind of place for like Data State or Benin, or even for this same Lagos mm. self, maybe in a low budget uh, side, you go build us sixty million naira every year. You go the end, maybe one million naira from the house. How many years it will take you to get the mm. money we take you the house? So you will be upcoming. I don't know what you they get. I get you. For somebody like, when I set up build the house for rent, not be for person who be say you people like the dangle thing. I don't know what they get. Mm. That person, if you build that thing for them, just to store the wealth. Mm. He store the wealth for that place. Mm. But you know, you never make money. You want to store wealth. What do you want to store? Okay, people will never make money now. So uh, what should what be should the focus in? when it comes to investment? Yes. Every investment in this life get lower level. Mm. Like now, you can still go into real estate as normal person. But mm. like me now, the way I go into real estate, I first of all start as a normal person. Will be so okay, I'll be middleman between a buyer and a seller. Okay. I don't know what they get. So the day you know, say real estate companies, they look for people to help them sell their properties. Then you know, see opportunity there for everybody to make money. Mm. You know that stuff. So you have friends abroad, even in Nigeria, you'll be saying they won't buy normal properties, but maybe they don't know who to trust, or maybe they don't know where to go do all these things. Mm. Uh, so your duty, you can connect a buyer, a buyer and a to seller. a seller. A seller. You get your commission. Do you spend your own personal money? No. The property where you they sell, now you get them. No, but you still make money. Let's say you sell a property of maybe twenty million naira. Okay. I don't know what you get. Mm-hmm. 20 million naira. They got to give you 10% of 20 million naira. You never still make money. Million so you see, say, now you want to see for you to make money from real estate. You want to go spend 100 million naira. Mm. Hey, if you spend 100 million naira. <laughs> so, so again, again, I, I know that mm. that is a thing. Yes. In fact, that is some people's job. Right. They call them realtors. Yes. They call them real estate professionals yes. and all that stuff. Mm. You know, yeah. they do that. But, I mean, I am a young girl who is probably a banker. Yes. My job is to wake up 4 a.m. every day. <laughs> yes. Get to my office by 7 a.m. Shop at the bank open 8 a.m. I finish 4 p.m. We will do um, uh, balance, balance sheets. Sheet. Till maybe like 6 p.m. Yes. I go home. I be I start going home. I get home by 8 p.m. All these things don't take my life. I no can't get, get time. You get home by 8 p.m. Which, okay. That's the whole pretend. That's the scenario. I don't do all this. Thing. On Saturday, I go still go do ATM duty. I mean, these are logical realities right. of young people in Nigeria. Mm. Even if it's not banking. Mm. People in normal corporate or other industries. Mm. It's a circle. I don't have time to be connecting buyer and seller. What is my starting point for investment for that kind of person? For that kind of person, like you, they work. Mm. Hmm? 
And I know if, mm. at the work, mm. my life is stressful. Yes. At the end, my Torah maybe 150 per, per month. Yes. Mm. And they go back to back, is work, 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 work. And you've given me a suggestion that I can invest in real estate in the form of connecting buyer, or I can make money from real estate in the form of connecting buyer and seller, mm. right? But that won't know if you work for me. Mm. But I still want to keep my small, small money, my 150000 where at the end. Maybe I want to keep 150000 At least I go start with savings. Yes, I, mean, yes. I go start saving, I go save mm-hmm. my 50000 every month. After I maybe gather it for three months and I have like 150000 mm-hmm. what can I invest in? What should I be looking at for those kind of people? Because those are the baseline. I understand. You know, when mm-hmm. it comes to talking about growing finances for young people. All this DC depends on the environment you are. You know, that's, it depends on where you did. Because let's say, for instance, now, the need of your environment, now, which it could really bring out the type of business or investment where you want. Because at the end of the day, you are serving people, mm. not yourself. Mm. Uh, the purpose of every business is to serve somebody, mm. and that person will come with a reward. The reward is what you yourself you are looking for. Mm. So now, what do people need for your environment? Because you need to go into research. It's about, because if I say, there are business that it's okay, if you they sell for this Lagos where you did, mm. that business is good, they profitable for Lagos. But that same business, if you cannot go to that state, mm. it's not going to work for you. Mm. So location, they affect all these things. So I know if you say, go do this type of business, when I never understand your location, mm-hmm. where you did. Mm. I don't understand. So but now, let's say, make a, move your make a general. With that type of money, tear as on era. People need food for this country. I don't know how they get. Like, as I not come and say, you won't go into business. You know, if you think of business, we'll be saying, like, you need to go into basic need, what people really need where. Mm. Because let's say, for instance, now, with the way the country, then I have shipped the country now. Right. First, if you tell you, say, from now to December, you don't want to buy new clothes. Mm. Because of, say, budget. I don't know what they get. Yeah. So if you know you be upcoming, you call it that, that type of business. You see, say, that decision by those people, see what they say, they don't want to buy clothes before the, end, the year go end again. It don't affect your business. Mm. I don't know what they get with yeah. that. Talk. So now, you call focus on, okay, wait till they serve poor man, if they serve rich man. It is serve even any type of religion safe. Mm. Not be food. Mm. Because person of it is from Nazi December, I know what eat food again. Mm. I don't know why they get. Mm. Mm-hmm. So, that- so you're saying <laughs> that you have to find basic needs? Yes. Of people. What, what people so, need and offer the service to them. Yes. So are you saying that business is also a form of investment? Business is different from investment. Okay. So I don't want to do business. I want, I to, want invest. to invest. That was basic. That was in the line of my thoughts when I asked the question. Uh, real estate is there now. With my 300,000 naira. Yes. Which I want to use. Which I want to use. You can to. buy. Like, let me go to make a tell you say, business is different from real estate, uh, from investment. Okay. You can buy a land with that uh, 300,000 naira. 300,000 Why not? Yeah. There are places they sell at 300,000 naira. Yeah. Is it in this economy or in the... In, the in this home. country, not in Nigeria, you did. I no, don't do real estate, I don't know, know where it lands. Let me tell you, you say, it depends on where you yourself uh, want to invest. Okay, but because it gets, it gets some kind place where, okay, let's assume, say, that 300k land day. Mm. It gets some kind place where, where say, you go see land, buy, but it's mm. not going to develop in the next many years. Where your money go go? Uh, let me look at it. It depends on the level where you did because you're not expected no, to get no, your retirement. Yes, I gave you the, the only yes. thing where I can't get now my 300,000. And I want me to bring me return. Let me give one you year. the best thing you go feel do. Now, it's about you they ask me for advice now. Mm-hmm. You they ask me what your money go feel do for yes. you. Yes. The way your money go fit to serve you. Yes. But now you're not going to say you're not going to like that one. You say you want to go into something to be say. Yeah. He you said I don't like that one. Cross <laughs> <laughs> you carry your cross now. Okay, let, uh, let, let's step aside from, from yeah, this for a bit. Let, let's go into fraud. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, because I, I think that from all of the things you've said, it, it, you've mentioned how mentorship is important right. before yes. you can, you know... It, Think of investing. You must follow people that have done these things before so that they can give you the tricks, the turns, and the things you should do and not do yeah. in order not to make mistakes, which is actually very brilliant. You also mentioned um, the need to start from the reality of life. Of life. You know that your you're in. Your you know, there, there's something. There's something in law. I'm trying to. I'm trying to remember um, that in our line with um, um, consideration and all of that. Talking about. Your the your stance in life, your point, the point you are in in life. You mm. also mentioned, and, and I think that's where a lot of people make a lot of mistakes because we want to invest above our grade <laughs> level. We want to go beyond and mm-hmm. over. You know, that's you're not thinking about your current realities. You're not thinking about your present state and in I life, and I think that's causes, very sound. What also causes that is, you know, like when you see others 
that are either like the same age as you or mm. who, are, who were supposedly on the same level as you mm. and then all of a sudden you don't know what they invested in the past, but all mm. of a sudden you just see them making it big. And I think that's where that w- that's what's going to lead us to the topic about yeah. fraud and yahoo yahoo the and quick stuff. money quick syndrome. Quick money syndrome, exactly. And so we see a lot of people falling for scammers these days. Like before we even talk about people that fall for scammers, let's talk about the trend of being a scammer or being a yahoo person mm. because you fall into quick money. What are people when people fall into quick money like that? What are they supposed to do with the money? Let's assume that will kill. I see money for flow. Mm, yes, <laughs> I see money you see money peak. I see money peak. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I don't know, but I know still because I don't know. I don't know who who, who, who get the money. I just see I'm for flow. I pick up. Mm. What am I supposed to do with such money? Uh, it depends on which how you see the money peak. Oh. <laughs> uh, but if you say you want if na yahoo money, okay. Uh, let's just yeah, let's do if na yahoo money. Uh-huh. My best advice. We will say they say your own money they get. All I don't understand. They want the advice says, Kama. Wait now. Wait now. Make it last. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you need advice. Make I know. I know. Understand. Trust me and tell me what I don't know. Who's Kama saying the advice now? So, okay. I say your boy now. Mm. You get money, which I not really advise me going to because the Yahoo na trap on its own. Like if you see people be say they don't make a lot of money from Yahoo. But if, if you see the life where they live today, even you would be saying you become a man, you're not making enough. You're still better than them. Mm. And the reason why, because they know they go into investment. You know, that's so I say, yeah, oh boy, you invest to save yourself from the trap. Because that you're not trap. That mindset, because you're yeah, give that mindset, say, okay, as you'd already, this will not come today, so another one will come. You know, understand? But the problem with that mm. is that... <laughs> You know, because the problem with investment, I wouldn't call it a problem, but mm. the challenge with investment is you're not seeing, you're not going to see the return on your investment yes. now, now, now. And so for Yahoo people, for, mm. for people that are into fraud, the the high for them is the mo- they, they are getting quick money. Yes. So nobody had, they don't, I don't, in my opinion, they don't have time to invest, to wait for that one to marinate. How much, Yahoo, how much Yahoo boy they make way not to get time? If they had the time, mm. they won't be doing Yahoo. If they have the time mm. and the patience mm. to actually work for money, mm. they won't try to be getting quick money. Yeah, because who, that's the whole point of being. Yeah, who person. had pass anything for this life? They don't yeah. 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 trap. Yes, they don't have have every a majority of Nigerian youth don't fall trap of Yahoo. And okay. if you say I'm not innocent of all these things, okay. At a particular point in my life, I evolved myself in all these things. So I feel tell you for free, say before me come up, you see, okay, normally I go see young boy like me now. They tell you say, you use your money well, use your money well. Where all these experiences come from? Because now street life. Mm. I wonder if they get now street life. So I've tell you for free, say, yeah, who had passed anything for this life? Today now, I don't know if you compare the life when they live now with the one beside they live when they do street How system. How Yahoo life had passed anything for this life? Mm, you know they sleep. And they use your brain wrongly. Who sent you? Who, who, who sent you? Me, 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 when they do normal work, self, I know they sleep. Don't sleep. Me, me, when they do business, self, I know they sleep. If you get business, you know they sleep. Because it don't even show say your money go go reach you. All the money where you don't but, but, spend. But, you I think, but I think moving away from the conversation because I know I know one may come be like say una they support waiting no waiting no day all right mm. and uh, it don't be don't be waiting one talk with exactly. that right. But looking at how people have actually continued to fall trap of quick money syndrome. Everybody mm. want make quick money, fast yeah. money. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Everybody, they promise return on investment. Return on investment is sweet. If I miss it, now one of my work with that, where mm. they tell people about ROI, ROI, ROI. That, that, it, 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 <laughs> ROI. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but looking at it, I know that people have been told over time you can't save your money in the bank. You have to invest your money. You are, but. Where, how do you satisfy an investment that is genuine? How do you recognize it so that you don't you fall know, into go for the trap? Trip, uh, you know, fall into the trap of people where go chop your money, run away because even the one where you see, you, say never, the you can't recover it. Do, do you know what even happens these days? These companies, this, um, you know, whatever they, they stay for, they, they stay in your faces for years, right. And because you've been checking them out, you probably feel like they are genuine. And it is when you you now put your money, you go, yes, something happened, they go disappear. We've seen a lot of that. 
from from crypto companies to this company and they tell you they ran into a problem money disappeared money you know, dis- MMM, you know that's why i kept I, I talked about mmm at the beginning i think when mmm when i heard the whole buzz of mmm i was still serving and then everybody or almost everybody at the lg office they kept on shouting my money don't go my money and i'm really thinking Something you've never heard of before. Mm. You told you to put money into this. It and then they will, they will, will connect you with this. somebody. Okay. And, and you, you t- and I'm like, even if you wanted to be brave, in quotes, mm. because my brave right now is just being very sarcastic. Even if you wanted to be brave, right, you don't go and put a large sum. Because some people were brave enough to put large mm. sums. You don't go and put in a large sum. Because uh, because that's what we call quick money. You want to generate money that you did not work for. Mm. What you have is 100K. You want to get 500k from 100k. What did you do with that 100k to generate 500k? Other than put it inside something that you don't know what they're using your money mm. for. So how... Uh, be, uh, the thing is, you don't even know if those things are legit. Some of them might be legit. Some of them are not legit. How do you now differentiate between the one that is legit and the one that is not legit? Any way they promise you, say, do an anana, you will see money, no, no, no. No problem. Because mm. the, one of the... The characteristics when I feel okay in a part of business or investment, na patience and endurance. Mm. Like what I tell you from the beginning, na seed. Mm-hmm. If you plant your seed, you have to wait eh, to germinate before you see fruit. Mm-hmm. So once all these things you not get them, you must fall into victim of quick uh, money. Uh, of yeah. quick money. Mm. So the so you see, say na out of greed mm. and oriori, they make you see before even your boy with the scam person, mm. the your boy they at fault. Even with the scam, mm. they are for because mm. not of quick money. Will you promise them something mm. that will be said they won't get? Mm. May you face scam them. True. So once you not get this patience, you not get this endurance, mm. you must fall into the trap. Mm. So it's about patience, patience. and endurance, endurance and yes. understanding that your investment is a seed. I think that's something that I'm taking out of this conversation. Yeah. So you know if you plant mango today, mm-hmm. one yes. repump yeah, tomorrow. Yeah, so yeah. if somebody is promising you quick money in the name of investment, then you would know that that seed, you go get accidents last, last. Yeah, <laughs> so even, when you, even when you invest in companies, because at the end of the day, you don't just it's not just real estate people mm-hmm. invest in. Sometimes people invest in businesses. Mm-hmm. They invest in companies. And you're not expecting that in the next two months, you're going to reap the, the profit. The profit. Yeah. You have or, to, dividend, or dividend, that they call exactly. it. <laughs> you have to wait. That's why when people buy stocks in companies, when people invest in companies, they are not looking at the now of the company, mm. but what you're looking at is the potential mm-hmm. or the potentiality that the company has in store for the future. Mm. So if you're looking for quick money at the end of the day, like people always say, I've heard it countless times, anything you get too quickly, you, the, you will lose it. In nah, that nah, mm. thing, you will lose it in, with the same speed. Nine, nine the money it. go go. Exactly, because that's why at the end of the day, you see front stars, I, I, I'm going to keep calling it, them yahoo because that's what we call them in nigeria <laughs> <laughs> that's why you see that a yahoo boy you you can tell a yahoo person just by their dressing because at the end of the day what they want to do is they want to show you that they've made it mm. they want to show you that they've made it and so you they spend money on silly things and that is again that's where it comes the well, business, well, the well, business well there are a few of, of them there are a few of them who probably yeah. do not even show off I mean, Anyways, the small, small, <laughs> upcoming. The small, small, upcoming, upcoming. You, will upcoming. Know. you will know, you will know, because that's where the whole business and mentorship thing that he said comes into play. For money, you if you worked for money, or rather, if you yeah, if you work for money, you will know how to. You should be, you be, you should be, be discreet, enough and yeah, discreet about how you spend your money. Mm-hmm. For, you will know when someone did not work too hard. To get something. To get, to, to get something. I totally agree with that. Ladies and gentlemen, the conversation has totally been enlightening. And I hope that you're jotting things down because, again, <laughs> um, there are so many things that we need as individuals. There's so many things that we aspire to become. And in all of these things, money is very important. And growing your finances or ensuring that you, you know, put your money in the right things for it to work for you is something that you need to do think about every single day yeah. and while thinking about it remember like our guest rightly said mentorship is key knowing people who will guide you into what you should be doing and not do and of course um, being patient or knowing that your investment is a seed that needs time to grow okay mm-hmm. not just um, looking for opportunities that will give you uh, millions in the next few <laughs> weeks in the next few months now nah. You need to know that it is a seed that needs time to grow. And when they start promising you ridiculous returns, run for your life. Because anything can happen 
within the space <laughs> of that premise. And right. trust me when I say that some of those companies actually start out genuine, but because they also become greedy. Right. Tin scatter, pepper scatter, yam scatter. <laughs> <laughs> yam pepper scatter, right? And before you know it, they start giving you story on how to pay your money on, on why they cannot pay your money. So, b- before we wrap up, right, you mentioned earlier about Yahoo Boys. I think we caught you up there. But you mentioned earlier about Yahoo boys mm. working harder than a lot of people. Can you expatiate on that? Because we're not trying, we're not trying to to justify, um, justify being scam. A scammer. Mm. We're not trying to justify scam. But what's the what, what what's the intent or what's the thought behind that? Yahoo boys work harder than every other person in this world. In the sense that maybe let's say for instance now, like what I said earlier before, your whole peace of mind. You know that's done. You know they sleep for night. Then uh, in the sense that maybe people will be say the evil day around you, where did they lead you to? Because if you know they do something illegal like Yahoo now, mm. which they go lead you to? Before you look now, you know they seek for fake prophets, mm. herbalists, mm. and all these barbaric things will be say you're not supposed to do normally before if you were doing something legal. Mm. I don't know what they get. Mm. Because as long as you don't do something evil, you must still go evil place. To let yeah, people back uh, to type up. back them up. So, say. peace of mind, don't uh, have because, this place. <laughs> yes, you are normally not something of hope. Yeah. Now, we they call life of hope because you don't know how the tomorrow will be. You just hope, say, man, I just find one person if he just scam today, you just send me money. Mm. So, because of say, it's not something like maybe not be your handwork, they breed the result. You must need something to back it up. Now, they go call carry you go. All these babies uh, carry you go place where, uh, you, where you, don't you don't know. know. <laughs> so, all those things, you should say, you can't make the thing hard more than the way you devote the thing about them. Okay. Mm. So, they work harder than every other person. But life. even in the process of working harder than any other person that you have said, yes. I'm, 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 I'm not agreeing, mm. but like you have said, they mm. work harder, in your opinion. But mm. you also know when someone just made quick money by the way they spend it. Right, so when you see a Yahoo boy mm. who has made quick money, mm. he's not thinking about the nearest investment or the the investment he's supposed to do. What he's thinking about is how he's how going to, to spend off, it, how he's going to spend it. Because mm. the reason what pushed him into Yahoo in the first place is abject poverty. Sakwa sat him down and said, "Today I will deal with you," and so he decided, that, "No, I am going to." make my money in whichever way I, I have to. And so what well, their their intent is to show off that, yo, I've, I've made arrived. It, I've arrived, right? So you see, by the way, they spend money. But then we also have entertainers who spend money lavishly. Mm. What's the difference between these two? Uh, the difference, like this issue of uh, people spending money to show off. Mm. I'm not sure maybe now because they make the money quickly. Okay. Mm. Now from these entertainers, all these things, they happen. You see, young person will be saying that thing we whiskey we hear, you won't wear. So, not really because they make your own money, and I make. I know people will be saying they do not my hard work. Mm. If that money still comes, they still carry that money, go do that same thing. Not mm. really. And if you see people will be say, if you go party, maybe if they come from the street, uh, if you go party, you see young boy, they throw money. Mm. I know people will be saying they borrow money to go spray. Mm. Don't be saying, don't be saying that your own money. So, all this is not be by your So, now this entertainer, they would inflex these people. Now, it's a thing as inflates your old boys. You won't, you won't live la- larger than yes. life. You won't, you so, won't live past yourself. Yes. So maybe, like, if you feel see maybe all these artists now, it's a thing as now they do certain things. Ordinary person for streets, no, no, say that thing a costume for mm-hmm. a particular thing. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. You know they feel you will still return yeah, after so, self. Yeah, so, and because, say, you don't see that person doing and he gets more money, he will find what he won't do, not because he see the money yeah. quickly, because he wants to be So, So, waiting will come be your advice for people where they look onto people where they know, say, I never reach that level, but I got to do anything to get mm. there. because I won't get there. What's your advice for people like that? Uh, now, there's self discipline coming. Mm. You need to discipline yourself. You know, understand? Mm. I know, say, everything get timing because some people, the reason we waited for this now, and because, say, some people don't reach 10 years to reach that level. But you now, you want to start the 10 years of that person, you want to use level one. Mm. Say, I should this thing. So when you feel discipline yourself, then a little bit of a uh, Okay, they okay for the position where you die. You know, it's okay. Normally, with time, you'll still get to that level. All those mm-hmm. things will help you. Mm-hmm. I want mm. us to deviate a little bit into profiling fraudsters. Mm. 
we've heard lots of news, lo lots of stories, especially in Lagos, mm. right? Of you, you see someone driving a white Benz. Up to now, I still know somebody that they will tell me that if you see if a car in white Benz, if somebody that is driving white Benz, yeah. you don't enter on that Yahoo <laughs> Do you get? So there's this whole idea of profiling, yes. right? So and then you've heard stories of policemen stopping people, even though they have legit business, just by the way. Now, they let, let me even bust your head. <laughs> As you just a policeman, I just realized that you know coming uh, driving down to the studio today i got to a point where there were a lot of policemen and i noticed that there were so many black cars, cars. parked at different points and then so there's like there are a lot of them so they now had to stop different black cars like yeah you park here another black car is there another are black car is there and i'm like why, why? is today for black car so it looks like for every black, black car, car that, that was passes, going by they, have to, they want to stop the person to see who it is bring your particular let's start let's asking you questions let's assume that there's been a case of stolen vehicle Nikki let's, Nikki. let's, let's give them a Nikki oh. so like you see we hear we hear stories like that and sometimes it doesn't even end well for the innocent ones you find out that they would have taken into custody and god forbid mm -hmm. some of them lose their lives in the process right mm -hmm. And then, so there's this whole issue of profiling because of how people dress. Yes. And there's a certain way your boy is dressed. Unfortunately, they affect the others. Yeah. So let's imagine now, you see the way the country did now. Nigeria government, particularly, mm. you, they know how much the minimum wage. I don't know that you get with at the top. Mm. So let's say now, you call the person be say, normally, you know, say, not get with it, they do. Because they, but how do they know? They, they, they must they, know the level do of. They, do they live with the person? No, it's not by you live with person. With As you see for a road now, you feel the level, of, know they, they, the exactly. level of unemployment in this country is normal for anybody to know. So normally, this boy not supposed to get with it. How? Oh. It's normal. Eh, I made the day now. It's normal. You know, you know, okay, wait, wait. How you go identify the kind of person? You see me for a road like this now. So I dress like this now. How you go know? Say so I get with her. They do. As a lady, I know that I talk about boys. So we no, say boys. we don't talk about your own boys now. Yeah, wait, 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 as a lady and as a boy, oh yeah, we attend to both of them. Oh yeah, as a guy, how do you know that my this one no gets what they do? You don't get what they do. How? Okay. You they live, are you the, in, the in this world of remote place? jobs and <laughs> tech and if all of that. The aspect of police mm. stopping somebody to say, yeah, as a day like this, now if you say countless times, even when this period of uh, Edsas, mm. police never stop me any day. Because Ooh. you think you look responsible. It's not by because I look responsible. Oh. You get, these people are their job. They're trained to do all these things. Okay. It's not their job. Because uh, have, let's, have, let's you, be have you heard about it. false accusations before? False, false accusations, they did normally be. Yes. Uh -huh. But not forget, out of those many, many people with police, they stop. Mm. Majority. They're guilty. They're guilty of what, all these Do things. you have the statistics for that? Mm, no, I don't have the statistics. So but you're just, it's just based on assumption? Yes, it's based on it's, assumption. It's be like saying you, you be a policeman. No, no, no. I get be, be police like, around. Be like, be like, be like. <laughs> because because honest, no, there see, is if, no way, there is no tangible way mm. to know all... To know a person's source of income, or just by a person's source of income, just by looking at them, it's not possible. You see someone on dreadlocks, yes, right, and yes. you assume the person is a Yahoo boy. You see someone driving a car, and you assume that the person shouldn't be able to afford, afford that. No, car. now where we, now where would they get this this wrong? Mm. Now where would they get this this wrong? Mm. The level of the country, mm. ordinary man, no see, yeah, mm. you the way you dress, this is what you wear. I know boys will be okay normally. Your, 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 just your appearance of normal things like this. Maybe your appearance like this costs 500k. I don't know whether they get. What do they do if they afford in a city? What if, Wait, what if I'm in tech? Or what if I'm earning in dollars? Uh -huh. You are earning in dollars. Uh -huh. It still depends on what do they, what do, you, they do. Let me, let me, let me, that's why they are, okay, what so are you doing. Okay, you, you're, uh, okay, your point is that mm. it is okay for them to ask you. Yes, you so. said you will come provide if answer. We are, if we were to oh. make sure that this country move forward. Mm. The guys ask yes, and say we that answer. Yes. Okay. But, 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 like, but, <laughs> but you are aware that it doesn't stop at just asking. Even if you provide them all the details they need to know. You are aware, right? <laughs> all this is what they talk talking. Me and I feel like, say, eh, the police, they do their work. Oh. Okay. I love it. Yes, I love that they're still job. a believer. I yeah. love it. I totally love it. Yeah. Oh, interesting conversation so <laughs> far. <laughs> and uh, believe me when I say we've had different aspects of this conversation. We've gone left, right, south, west. And one of the things we're still driving home is the fact that you need to be cautious about how you spend your money, what you put your money into, and of course, being futuristic about investment. investment because right. at the end of the day, like we've said over 
over and over again. It's about time and season. It's not something that would happen overnight. It's not a quick uh, get rich quick syndrome, you know, and you should just be patient and follow the people who sabi road. We have to wrap up now. It's been an interesting conversation so far. Uh, but let's talk about an advice you would give your younger self in line with investment. What would that be? Mm, the best advice is this. Start small, then grow with time. You mm. understand? Mm. Because the reason for failure, and when you, like we had talk before, when you want to start from level 10, mm. without following the process. Mm. So, if you begin small, you go expand. That's why you say today, the reason why many businesses they fail today, you'll see people say, maybe let's assume like a baby salon, mm. uh, for instance, something like that. The first time they told put that baby salon, hmm? mm. maybe that they use AC, they get POP and all these things before. Mm-hmm. But you can't see as you call the good there, the AC is poor, you know, they function again, then the walls where they did, the, everything not dirty, they're not fit maintain them again. Mm. You also you lose customer by that because it could be like say the people they're not gonna fit trust you. Mm. Because people like success, success story. Mm-hmm. So if they say that success, you know they get them, um, it could be like say they go they deviate from you, it could be like say you go they lose the customers much more. But let's assume say you start a place with ordinary fan, for instance. So, but the next time the customer come, na AC did that place. Eh? Na P- PVC did that before. We cost you that to POP. Hmm? You see, say, people go like, ah, be like this boy, they upgrade. Mm. That same thing where you're facing and nothing. So it they mean you they build the customer, the love and the loyalty. Mm. Because they feel like say, they're part of your success story. Mm. And people love to associate with success. Mm. Right. So you grow like that. And see, you can start big, you got the downgrade. Mm. So it better mean you start small. Can't go big. I think wow. I love yeah. that's I that, love, that, that analysis. I think I love it. So much, Mr. Gege. All right, welcome. I mean, he, 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 <laughs> we've said a lot of, you've said a lot of controversial things <laughs> right <laughs> here. <laughs> Opinions flying here and there, but thank you so much for, um, you know, joining us today. Right. Yeah, and we should success in your future endeavors. If, if, if you ever do hold classes on investments mm. let me know all right don't worry yeah. <laughs> <laughs> let me know yes moya thank you so much for i think moya was just here to keep the cool because my dear if you left don't leave mm. me <laughs> in this world where i did so i know like problem no, i think moya was just here to keep it cool because me i would have driven it to the last because <laughs> i really want to hear it but thank you moya for keeping the cool because I get coconut head. You get. We know. <laughs> we know. So you get coconut head. <laughs> but ladies and gentlemen, that's about it on the show today. You yes. guys. We, we hope that we did justice to this and we hope that you learned one or two. Okay. Remember to share this video. Um, subscribe to the channel. Share this. Spread it across. Come back always because every week we would definitely be feeding you with something that you will love to listen to. Mm-hmm. And that's definitely our job. And we trust that we would continue to deliver Till yeah. next time when we come your way with Yay. another interesting conversation. So long, farewell. Yay. Thank you so much. Good job, Goodbye. <laughs>